ninjutsu tubers, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IV The After Years with me, Blink. We've got the whole team together, and we're all ninjas, so it's much ninja action today. And uh, for the most part, we can just roll right through these r random encounters, and we don't even have to stress about it. I was thinking maybe we should have a look at some uh, bands or something. There's got to be some bands between everybody. We picked up a new ability there. Shadow Bind. I assume something like Hold. Maybe check this for treasure right away. Chain Whip. So, um... Well, let's see. Let's compare. 4 times 34 at 80%. Versus... Three times thirty-eight at sixty, so that's not even close. Yeah. Higher hit chance, more hits. Pretty much the same damage either way, really, the same attack power, so might as well go with that. Plus it tends to work well on flying enemies. So that's interesting. Edge did learn Shadow Bind, but he learned it at a higher level, like level twenty-five instead of twenty. Curious. So, are we about to go get killed by a mysterious girl? What do you guys think? Should we be leveling up even more? <laughs> I mean, we're getting levels up like crazy, so... There's always that. I'm pretty happy with Tsukinawa's damage. Edge, of course, is amazing. I think Tsukinawa went twice before Gekko got a turn, didn't he? That's something to keep in mind. Yeah, he's, he's like about twice as fast as Gekko. Yeah, he actually gets two turns before Gekko gets to go. Gekko is just sitting around doing nothing. <laughs> That's interesting. I mean, I assume we've got a boss battle here, so... I might throw down a quick save or something. Hopefully you won't, uh, mind too much. Oh, Gecko gets a turn! Yeah, he might be the weakest link just by virtue of not being fast enough. Visions from Rubiconte? Speaking to you from beyond the grave. I mean, he is an elemental fiend. I don't think you can ever permanently banish him. The elements still exist, right? Run, run as fast as you can. Oh, it's his parents. Sure. Ghosts. That's great. Or it's Rubicon visions of his ghost parents. Or Edge is just going crazy. Well, let's find out what happens if we go up. Ninja attack! Yeah, this is our planet. Don't provoke her. There's no use explaining. Well, if you could just explain yourself, maybe we wouldn't have to fight. As I said before, I'm pretty sure Edge, in combination with Cecil and the rest of the team, did take one of these down before. I mean, her down before. We're very adaptable. Don't let your guard down. Uh-oh. <laughs> you don't need to know, but now that I think you're a, a bit able to level up, we're gonna have to fight for real. Okay, so... I don't know. Doesn't seem like a lot of damage to me. It's uninterested. I, have, I can't imagine this is gonna work. 
It totally doesn't work. None of our special abilities ever work. Yeah, that's the problem with special abilities. It's just, it's just, they never work on bosses. I don't even know if this is a scripted battle or not. Ifrit? What has happened to Rydia? Well, whoever's got Flood can use Flood. One damage, okay. Scripted, maybe? You know, water should work good on the uh, God of Fire. That's <laughs> zero. Alright, well, I don't think we can do much here. Well, yeah, Firaga, huh? So, who's dead? Well, not quite. Take a chill pill. Maybe we just ignore Ifrit and focus on her, I guess. but it's not killing anybody in one shot, so... We can definitely heal up from the occasional Firiga. Eh, fine. I'm thinking of keeping Izayoi on heal duty. Not getting a whole lot of damage. Uh, this one might hurt. Special attack! How much? How bad is it, boss? It's nothing. Trap? What are you talking about? That didn't even hurt. You totally missed. Oh. Just runs away? Well... Uh-oh. Quick! Use your smoke bomb! Just like before! It's like a reimagining of what happened 20 years ago. trying to escape the inevitable. Incom it's incomprehensible these guys would try to stay alive. It's really that bad? That room you never get to see normally. You always fall in because it's a trap. Do you have a plan? Clever escape. Bounce, bounce, bounce. I was expecting the old man to uh, fall flat out on his face again. That would have been better. It's kind of ninja stronghold. Yeah, well, the last time we went through here with... Uh, well, I guess two times ago. The first time we went through here with uh, Edge, we all fell down that trap. And it wasn't so funny. <laughs> because there was a bunch of crystals up there. Alright. Cool. Battle... Was this the Battle with the Four Fiends theme music? No, this is just boss music. Just battle music. Just normal music. What? You freed? I guess we gotta run. <laughs> Leave us alone, you freed! We're just humble ninjas. Looking for some treasure. <laughs> That's kind of cool. We can do this forever? What are you talking about? Totally fine. Uh, 
I could do this all day! Where are you taking us? Out of this tower. Ifrit's pretty slow. Who is that girl? Well... She's mysterious, that's much as true. As far as the treasure is... <laughs> Look, I know we're in a rush to escape from a freed, and we just corner ourselves. The plan is, get the treasure. I mean, maybe I could try to fight it, but... I'm pretty sure you're supposed to run. I'm, I'm getting some hints from, from the ninjas that we should be running away. Here we go! Now where are we? Do you think there's an airship here again? I mean, history is repeating, apparently, so... You know, if this is how Cecil escaped, this is how we could escape. Oh, back in the days when we had Riddy and Rose at our back, and Kane and Edge at our side. Now we just got a bunch of silly ninjas, and no airship. Hmm. It is a dead end, isn't it? Well, we could jump into some lava, that might work. Are you done? Never! <laughs> I admit you got me. <laughs> yeah, what happened to Baron and Cecil? The real Cecil? <laughs> I'm glad at least one character can see it. The terrible, terrible repeating of history. Our kind have a little something called instinct. Sacrifices his four ninja friends to die. Oh, you mean you can just jump from here? Gah! Geronimo. That's insensitive. That's racially insensitive. <laughs> <laughs> Choosing death of their own free will. Incomprehensible. I don't think that word means what you think it means. So, what you gonna do? Some airplane gonna save you at the last second? <laughs> well, airship. Thanks, Rudy, for just happening to be flying underneath us. How did you, uh, know? This is how it worked the last time, so... I haven't died, gone to heaven. Ha! <laughs> Cause you's an angel! <laughs> History's repeating itself, that's all. I knew an airship would catch us if I jumped from this exact spot, so we're all good. There had to be an airship there. Freaking ninjas. Hey, Luca! Looking good, yeah! <laughs> Not as good as you are. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. I thought she had a thing for Palum, but I guess Edge is pretty hot stuff. Oh, right! Right! Hey, man in black. What's going on? Who are you? Where did you come from? Why is Rydia back in the underworld now? I guess time is caught up. Remember, all of the individual missions were... separate. Alright! Well, I guess that's the end of uh, Edge's tale. So, his tale, I guess, lines up with the end of Rydia's tale, where the black man, <laughs> the man in black, saved her from Titan, and then they, uh, they must have gone back into the underworld for some reason. 
Who knows why? Now, we're only 15 minutes in here. Didn't take as long as I was thinking. I guess we could go check out the challenge dungeon. See where this throws us. Pretty sure the uh, challenging way guy was in here. Kind of a, a strange tail edges because it's so split up between all the different parts. Wasn't there... There is an armor and weapon shop somewhere, isn't there? I mean, I never, I never really went shopping with the whole crew. I might not have ever even checked this tower out, did I? Yeah, we did. Maybe there's no, maybe there's no shop here. There's probably no shop. Let's, uh, let's give it a quick run. Oh no, oh no, shop. There was a shop, of course there was. So two metal boomerangs for that kid? Suki now is already doing pretty good on the damage. Yeah, that's a small upgrade. There you go, buddy. Hmm. Some people. Most of them are wearing shinobi gear, which is four and three. The Kempo is five and two. That's a straight upgrade for at least one of them. Although I have. Okay. I obviously didn't go through my inventory very well. Oh, but it's less attack power. That's fine. Now, I bet you the shinobi gear gives you some speed or something, right? 15 speed. Yeah. Well, Gecko is so slow, I bet you the speed is better than the, uh... The offense and defense, actually. Because he doesn't get enough attacks. Yeah, that seems fair. Don't want to spend too much time messing around. Alright, well, uh, let's put a save in here and uh, see how bad the challenge dungeon is. If we're lucky, we could make it through it once for today's episode and then I can do my grinding off camera. I have no idea how difficult this will be. Some of them have been pretty tough if you don't level up, but some of them have been pretty easy too. Okay, speed challenge. Get to the chest at the end as quickly as possible. 10 minutes to get probably the best reward. Okay. You always receive an item at the end. I get the feeling that the 10 minute or less item is probably the boss item from all the other dungeons. Alright folks, 10 minutes. That's enough time for this episode if we can make it. Go, go, go! Alright, we're already fighting monsters that are actually pretty strong. <laughs> Yeah, oh, we're off to a great start. Freaking... Well, that didn't kill us. Okay, hold on. Maybe we can kill a lamb yet. This is a surprisingly tough first battle. You can't entice Izayai. Izayoi. Yeah, these guys have a lot of HP. Wow. So, we barely win the first battle. That's... <laughs> that's not a great start, I gotta say. Should have bought some Phoenix Downs. Oops. Alright, well that was one of our minutes. We're... okay, let's just be honest here. We're not gonna be getting uh, the 10 minute award on... What? That's not even close! I don't even have enough Phoenix Downs! We lose! We're dead already! I guess I should have stocked up better, but... <laughs> Alright, well this is gonna be a real fun challenge dungeon. We're gonna have to find somewhere to level grind before we even go into this dungeon. These guys are pretty tough, but... I think we can kill them? They hit pretty hard, is the thing. But with a group of, well, if we had all five, it would be not too bad. Wow. So I wonder if we can... Well, 
What if I can get lucky and find a Phoenix down or something? I suppose the first couple times through, you gotta map the area out anyway. Find all the chests and stuff, but... Well, Zangetsu's gonna fall behind on the experience here, because I can't... Can't do much with him. Oh, good. These caterpillars are surprisingly strong. Really strong. Counter with slow, which isn't that big a deal. Whew! Well, I uh, I don't expect us to be uh, as successful on this as I originally was hoping. Okay, good. We've we've confused like three quarters of the team now. From a caterpillar and a bug. That looks scary. How much damage can that do? Fair bit. Um. Sorry for the smack there, I had to kill a mosquito. Um. I don't think we can kill this thing. <laughs> Confused. Kills himself. I mean, I... We get one more hit, maybe. No, we just kill ourselves. Well, that's great. Okay, so this is one of those challenge dungeons that you can't just walk in and have any chance at all. So that sucks. Um... I don't even know where we're going to be able to go to level up, but, uh, I guess that's my problem and not yours, so, cheers to that. Um, yeah, I guess I'm just going to have to figure this out on the own, on my own. I'll be back next episode with, hopefully, uh, well, I'll probably be level 40 by then, but, um, I'll show you how that dungeon actually works once we're at a higher level. And um, once I know where to go. So I'll just have to fill you in on what treasure we get and stuff. But there's no way. There is no way that we can make it through that dungeon right now. With our current strength. So, um. I mean, maybe you can do a couple battles. And then use a, uh, an emergency exit to escape. Let's test that out, actually. Because I'm certainly going to get more experience in there. If we, um. If we could do that. Also, I've probably... Yeah. While I'm thinking about it, I'm going to buy some of these. We've got no raise spell. Some of these might be nice too. We never really picked this kind of stuff up. But yeah, they do sell emergency exits. So maybe we can just fight for a bit and then leave. I don't know. But anyway, spend some money. Put a save in here. What I'll try to do is like... Let's go like... Do like one or two fights. And uh... See if I can just emergency exit out. Because that's how I'll be um... Grinding for experience. I probably should have... Slept for the day too, but... So, these guys maybe aren't as bad. Nagaraja. Nagaraja. Still got a lot of HP though. Oof. But they've got no counter attack. Which means we can sort of pummel on them. Yeah, so some experience. Try to do a couple fights. Um, oof. Gecko's dead. Wow, things hit really hard here. I guess we'll try to do this one properly. Can't just rush through. Well, except that they're gonna just one-shot us, like... I don't think we're going to be able to win this fight with everyone alive. Unless I just go through all of my Phoenix Downs. 
Well, I mean, they're not that expensive. <laughs> it just keeps picking on Sukinawa. Well, no levels up for him. Wow, this is gonna be... Assuming we can actually do this and, and use an emergency exit to get out. This is gonna be grinding hell. You know, unless we find some really good loot or something that makes everything much easier. Yeah, no, this guy... One attack! Yay! All right, well, can we get out of here? All right, so that's what you have to do. <laughs> that is brutal. We weren't even in, like, strong melee mode or anything. That's just insane. All right, well, I guess I've got some work to do, so I will, uh, I'll put the break in here. Hopefully this, uh, resurrects everyone as well. I guess I'll just have to tell you the story later on about how I managed to to accomplish this dungeon. Alright folks, thanks for watching, hope you've enjoyed. Wish me luck. I, uh, I'm not a huge fan of this level grinding challenge dungeon business, but uh, I guess it's going to be interesting. <laughs> We've been wiped, pretty much wiped both times, and at least you can get out, so we'll fight a couple monsters using emergency exit, try again until we get levels up. Alright folks, thanks for watching, hope you've enjoyed, and have a better day than I am. <laughs>